What's up, YouTube? Alright, so I had a chance to get inside the UPS and change all the settings. I have it set on 99 packs installed. I'm going to go for 24 hour test 2. I did recharge the packs a little bit for a couple of hours, actually. I stayed down here for a couple of hours and recharged the pack a little bit off the wall and nothing blew up. Uh, I don't remember what the voltage setting was. I think it was 53. 4 or 54.3, I don't remember, but it's had a couple days to sit around and do absolutely nothing, so I figured why not do another test. I don't want to do too many load tests right now because I don't have the solar panels hooked up, but I do plan on getting those installed, hopefully in the next week, I hope. But anyway, I don't want to drain them down too much because I don't want them to sit around dead the entire time. So I'll probably let it run for another 24 hours just to make sure that the UPS will stay on. Uh, uh, before I do that, I'll check the voltage real quick so we can get a before and after, and then I'll also give you the time. And I'll do the exact same 100 watt light bulb. Alright, the voltage is 53.6. Okie doke. Now the last test, I think, I think it was at 57.4 or 6 or something around there, so I'm not starting at that voltage, but it should stay on, right? I guess we'll find out. Go ahead and turn it on real quick. All right, we are up and running. Let me grab the light bulb real quick. All right, I'm just gonna set this light bulb on the handle again. Okay, so we don't have anything plugged in yet. It's zeroed out. All right, zero kilowatt hours and zero timer on the clock. So I'll plug them in. Turn him on, and the time is 2.30 on Tuesday, August 22nd, 2.30 a.m. So that's our starting time. And just so everybody knows, it is 0.77 of an amp. We're putting out 120 volts, 0.1. Uh, 93 watts and hertz. 59.9 and I think somebody was asking me if I knew if this was a pure sine wave output on battery I believe if you have this hooked up to a modified sine wave it actually says DC across here it won't show 59.9 or 60 Hertz at least ones in the past that I've looked at okay so that will be our 24 hour runtime test all right, so that's going to be round two for the 24 hour runtime test. I basically just want to make sure that the UPS is going to stay on. And I know once I have the solar hooked up, hopefully every day the sun will be out and recharge the battery so it should never shut off. But I do want to make sure that the event that the sun does not come out for a couple of days, which it does happen here quite often, that the UPS will stay on. So this time I'm not gonna hook up any laptops or anything like that. I, I'm, it could have been the problem last time. I'm, I'm not 100% sure on that. Some people say it is and some people say it isn't. So I'm not gonna hook up any laptops this time and I will report on it tomorrow. Yay, 24 hours without a problem. No shutting off or nothing. All right, you guys, that is 24 hours straight of a whole 77 watts being pulled from the power rack without a hitch. So far, it's been doing good. It looks like all packs are roughly 3.58 and I'll move this light bulb out of the way real quick and we can get a whole pack reading if you want. The whole pack is 49.8 volts. I'd say that's not too bad of just sitting here running 24 seven or just 24. So what do you think? Should we let it keep on going? Go for 36 hours and then 48 for 48 volts, maybe? Why not, right? Let's do it. I'll just let it keep on going. All right, so this is the actual timer on there. You can see how it says clock right up on top. 
So that's not too bad. And so far I've pulled out 2.25 kilowatts. Nothing but light. And let's see, we're still putting out 120.5 volts, 0.77 amps, 93 watts, and 59.9 hertz. Alrighty, well I will let that keep on rolling. So it's still going. 24 hours straight. No problems yet that I've noticed. I think the voltage is holding out pretty good, even though it's only, what, 77 watts or 0.77 amps? 93 watts, that's what it was. Yeah, I think it's going pretty good. And once I get solar hooked up to it, oh man, that's gonna be so awesome because it'll just go every day unless I get a whole bunch of clouds or something. So yeah, I guess I will just let it keep on going as long as the voltage doesn't get down too low. And I'll put another update out there at 36 or 48 hours if it goes that long. Alright you guys, wish me luck. I'll see you on the next one. By the old and... Yeah, but you probably can't see that, can you? Hell no. And... Land focus? The, the AP, uh, uh, or I don't know, yeah, um, I'm guessing